Hello friends. Today we're working on dusting still for our spring cleaning project. Now we all know that I hate to dust like it's the nemesis. Don't like to do it <laughs> in any way, shape or form. So I have to bring along a friend to help me with the dusting today. So dusting is no match for the dusting ninja. Yeah. <laughs> all right. So when I do, when I do dust, I like to use two dusting mitts so I can statically charge these things together. If you only have one, that's okay. Rub it against itself, rub it against your pant leg. Get that good static charge in so that the dust will literally jump into your dusting mitts. So we are gonna go over electronics today and knickknacks. So got my entertainment center here, I got my TV. I'm gonna show you how I dust these to get them all nice and spring cleaned. So here we go over here. See, I've got this little charged up and how easy is it to be able to just grab my stuff I can wipe down everything really easy. Yeah, it's on there. All right. After I get surfaces dusted with my television, um, I like to, before I'm gonna wipe it down with my tech cloth um, to get those fingerprints and stuff off, I do like to pull the dust off because if I'm using my tech cloth and rubbing the dust on there, I don't wanna scratch my TV. Um, so I will take my Enviro wand or my dusting mitt charge it up a little bit and just give the TV a quick wipe down just to pull that surface dust off. The dust tidy back there because dust harbors so many chemicals and bacteria and all kinds of nasty stuff for us. So the more we can reduce the dust in our home, the better off we're going to be for allergies, just for breathing um, and keeping people from getting sick. So once I have wiped down the dust off of my electronics, I am going to take my handheld system. So I've got the window cloth on here, but I like to use, especially on this big TV, um, because those TVs have those special coatings on them. I like to use the tech cloth. Now the tech cloth is super, super fine. Very much like the optic scarf, only it has sticky nubs on the one side. So you can like keep it on your hand when you're trying to clean things off. So I like to put it on because I can't reach the top of my TV. <laughs> So I like to take my tech cloth and put my handheld system and kind of connect it to that. I just kind of tuck it under here a little bit and voila, I have a tech cloth cleaning pad. <laughs> and so then I can just take this and go, I can almost make it to the top <laughs> and wipe my TV. I can use a little bit more force to help me get those fingerprints. So you know, my kids touch down here on the end bottom of the TV, and I can use that tech cloth with a little bit of force to make sure that I'm getting it all good and clean. Ah, no more fingerprints. So super easy. And your, again, your tech cloth, it is designed for those special coatings that are on your TVs and your computer screens, not going to cause any damage to them. So tech cloth is great to have when you're doing these kind of devices. Okay, Dusty Ninja is ready to go do some knickknacks. You ready? Okay, so I've got these windows up here with these blinds that never get dusted. Love this Enviro one that I can bend and I can just get up here and grab this dust. It's hanging out on the bottom of these window sills. Let's do some knickknacks. So with the two, it makes it again, very easy just to grab and dust and you can get them all clean. So my fake plants are, um, you know, me just shoving. <laughs> They're really not professionally done, but it is very easy to dust them, even though they are not going to stay together very well with my dusting mitt. Ta-da! Super easy to keep those suckers clean. Let's do something big here. The dust is real, baby. All right, what are you gonna dust today? I wanna see your pictures, see that you have been able to get rid, eradicate this nasty stuff in your houses today, going after knickknacks and electronics, have lots of fun, and I'll see you tomorrow for ceiling fans. <laughs>